Welcome to Morning Prayer on this, the Feast of Our Lady of Lourdes and the Day of Prayer for the Sick. It's also our second HCPT International Day of Prayer. So please join me by making the sign of the cross in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Throughout this day, we will be praying with you and for you while we are here in Lourdes. All around the world, people are sending us their prayers, either electronically or by text. We have received them and we are going to pray those prayers and light candles for everybody that has asked us to pray for them and for their intentions. So we just take a moment, we pause as we start this day to pray for everybody in the HCPT community. We pray for everybody here in Lourdes. We pray for the pilgrim peoples who are desperate to come on their pilgrimage. Amen. A reading from the prophet Isaiah. Do not be afraid, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. You are mine. Should you pass through the sea, I will be with you, or through waters, they will not swallow you up. Should you walk through fire, you will not be scorched, and the flames will not burn you. I am the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, your Saviour. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. That is one of the most beautiful passages in the Old Testament from the prophet Isaiah. Do not be afraid, I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name, you are mine. We are children of God, chosen by God called to live as children of God, pilgrims on a journey together. Father John Loughran, in his book, The Miracle of Lourdes, uses this passage to talk about pilgrims. Today you are a pilgrim on a journey through life. Sometimes you have to leave your home, your family, your friends, to find yourself among unknown faces, in unfamiliar places, a little lost, searching for a look, a word, a smile, not to feel alone. Other pilgrims, like you, walk the same road of life, often entrusting their cares to Mary, praying, beseeching, imploring. On this feast of Our Lady of Lourdes, on this world day of prayer for the sick, we entrust our cares to Mary. We pray to her. We ask her support and her prayers as we continue our journey of life. As we pass along the streets of life, we look to those around us. We see the poor, we see those in need, we see those who search for our help and those who can help us. And we're called on that journey to reach out and to touch their lives for good. Today, wherever you are, wherever, whatever you might be doing, Look into the eyes of those around you, offer the love of God, and receive the love of God. The response to our prayers, Lord, may your mother pray for us. Lord, may your mother pray for us. Let us proclaim the greatness of our Saviour, who chose to be born of the Virgin Mary. Confident that he will hear us, we ask, Lord, may your mother pray for us. Son of Justice, you showed your day by dawning in the Immaculate Virgin Mary. Help us walk in the daylight of your presence. Lord, may your mother pray for us. Eternal Word in living flesh of Mary, you found a dwelling place on earth. Remain with us forever in hearts free from sin. Lord, may your mother pray for us. Christ our Saviour, you willed that your mother should be there when you died. Through her intercession, may we rejoice to share your suffering. Lord, may your mother pray for us. Loving Saviour, while hanging on the cross, you gave your mother Mary to the mother of John. Let us be known as her children by our living ways. Lord, may your mother pray for us. Lord, remember us in your kingdom, as following your teaching we say, 
Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Lord of mercy, as we keep the memory of Mary, the Immaculate Mother of God, who appeared to Bernadette at Lourdes, grant us through her prayers strength in our weakness and grace to rise up from sin. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless us all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Go in peace. Enjoy your day. Thanks be to God. Oh, let them.